Good day, everybody. How are you all? Today, we are going to solve a set of equations uh, by substitution. Uh, we are solving simultaneous equations by substitution method. So, I will share my computer screen with you. It says, solve the system of equations by substitution method. So the first thing we'll do is change the color of the pen. Okay. So solution. So we have a two equations. These are called simultaneous equations also. 3x plus y equal to 1. We will call this equation 1 and call this equation 2. So equation 1 is x plus y equal to 3. Okay. If we subtract x on both sides of this equation, and the x on the left cancels and we are left with y equal to 3 minus x. We call this equation number 3. Substitute for y from 3 into 2. So we have 3x plus y equal to 1 is your number 2. And we are going to substitute for y. So we are going to write 3x plus 3 minus x equal to 1. Now 3x minus x, minus x minus minus 1x. As you know, in algebra, we do not write the coefficient of 1. So 3 minus 1 is 2x plus 3 is equal to 1. Okay, so if I reduce this a little bit and uh, move this further up, we get some space for ourselves. So 2x plus 3 equal to 1, we will subtract 3 on both sides. So 2x is equal to 1 minus 3. Now 3 is greater than 1. So from 3, we will subtract 1. 3 minus 1 is 2, but we will keep the negative sign of the larger number, which is 3. So 2x equal to minus 2. Now divide by 2 on both sides. So x is equal to minus 1. Okay. x equal to minus 1. So... Again, uh, okay. so x is equal to minus 1. So now substitute the value. of x equal to minus 1 in equation 3. So equation 3 is y equal to 3 minus x. Or we can write uh, y equal to 3 minus and x value is remember minus 1. I wrote this in parenthesis because I did not want to confuse the sign. Two minuses will make this a plus. So this will be y equal to 3 plus 1 is equal to 4. So my solution is x equal to minus 1, y equal to 4. Okay. okay. So this is my solution set. I can check 
by plugging in any equation. So if I have x plus y equal to 3, which is equation 1, let's substitute x value and y value on the left. So x is minus 1 and y is 4. And 4, this is 4 minus 1. And this is equal to 3 on the left-hand side. And this is the left-hand side. And, and this is equal to 3 on the right-hand side. So it balances out. It matches. The left-hand side matches the right-hand side. So the solution is x equal to minus 1 and y equal to 4. Sometimes this is also written as minus 1 comma 4 as your set of solution solution set. Where the final uh, first number indicates x and the second number indicates y. I will stop here today. If you have any question or comment, write me a note. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. I really appreciate that. If you like this video, please share it with your friends so that your friends and yourself, you can subscribe to my channel by hitting the red subscribe button at the bottom right corner. I'll see you next time with another interesting problem, interesting solution. Take care. Have a nice day. See you.